want to thank first and foremost the mayor and the city council members for allowing people of all persuasions and all faiths and all creeds and all colors and all everything. <laughs> I'm so exceedingly proud and humbled to share in the procedural vote unanimously granting <clears throat> LGBT civil unions a few weeks ago. And I shall be equally and wholly proud and humbled to stand with you tonight upon formal passage of this measure, granting equal rights for an equal people before the state. I feel it is wholly reflective of every little thing of this town, as well as our wonderful new mayor and the city council members, that we stand in the name of love, recognition, and equality over and above the thoroughly provincial sanctimony and bigotry of those who deem such matters deviant. We respect all viewpoints and all colors and all wonders in this human experience and shall never feel threatened by the oft-times provinciality of societal moray or outright brute demagoguery from the holier than nows. And there's no sense of rightness or self-righteousness to be found in the all-consuming love of God. What or whosoever entity or reflection that might be for you. God's word, by, ver by very virtue, of its textual nature is, a pure, is purely interpretive and, and the speculative endeavor at best. And no one group or individual wields co-option or agenda <coughs> over those words or their understanding or interpretation thereof to sanctify a particular point of view over and above anyone else's. Or in this particular case before us here in Bisbee as the grounds to enact legislation. I feel that this love and surrender through marriage in whatever guise of religiosity is thoroughly coextensive with the love we share with and immerse in holy with our partners, husbands, wives, beloveds, and all the wondrous rest. And most importantly, if we as society choose to grant certain benefits, tax, insurance, or otherwise, to those who marry out of utmost love and devotion, in other words, it's state-sanctioned recognition, then consistent, it seems to me, it must be, irrespective of color, creed, or orientation, unless you officially wish to go on record as posing state-sanctioned discrimination. The LGBT group, of which I'm not a part of, I'm a heterosexual male, the LGBT group is unequivocally not a special interest group, as you've heard many people say tonight. We are all co-equals by and before the eyes of God. Bisbee loves you and stands with all in embracing all people of all persuasions before the eyes of the state and equally before the eyes of God forever and ever. Amen. Amen.